This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. All right, man, let's go back. We're going back to 1996, Atlanta. And, uh, man, you broke your freaking neck and became the Olympic gold medalist. It's been 25 years since you won it. How crazy is that? You know, it's a cliche, but uh, it goes by so quickly. I mean, that was half my life in 25 years. It seems like it's been, it was like yesterday, really. Yeah, man. And you put a lot of time, effort, and energy, I'm sure. And we're going to get into that now. And I want to talk about where we kick it off here with the path and journey of you getting there. I don't think everyone understands how much time and training. I mean, really, your life was dedicated to just not winning the gold medal, but to get to the Olympic trials. Can you explain to our listeners how much you poured yourself into this? Well, I did 300 hours of training a month. That's 10 hours a day. I ate, slept, and drank wrestling. That's all I did. It's all I dreamed about. It's all I focused on. And I, I had a goal, and I wanted to accomplish it. And it's what I set out to do. And I did everything possible to make it happen. Yeah, Kurt, you definitely did. You made it happen. When you started your wrestling journey, so think about the early days becoming a wrestler. Was it your dream right out on the onset to become an Olympic medalist? It was a dream. You know, a lot of people say, did you have that goal of winning the Olympics when you were younger? I, I set smaller goals at every level I wrestled at. So in elementary school, I wanted to have a winning record. I ended up getting one. And then I, it got me the confidence to go to the next level, which was junior high. And I wanted to have an undefeated season. I did that. And then in high school, I wanted to win states. And I won states. And then it gave me the confidence to go to college and go for the NCAA championship. I won two of those. So every level gave me the confidence to set goals for the next level. So I wouldn't say it was a goal when I was a kid. It was a dream, and I made it happen. And I made it happen through hard work and consistency. No, man, it makes a lot of sense. I think that's what we've also seen transition over to your wrestling uh, career, hard work and consistency. You know, we talked about a little bit a few weeks ago, your development and your personality, but everything that it seems like you've put your hand to, you've done it with all your might. I dive in with everything. I, I, you know, I, I get really uh, involved in it. So I have to have, uh, I have OCD, so I got to be doing this all the time. This is like, <laughs> You know, now it's the Kurt Angle show. Everything is, you know, focused on this show now because I, I have to be that way. I have to be. I'm very competitive that way. That's where we come up with the I in intensity from. So there you go. <laughs> One to three. I. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.